Daniel's first fireworks. It was almost nighttime in the neighborhood of Make Believe, and Daniel and his family were having a picnic dinner in the backyard so they could see the fireworks. Daniel had never seen fireworks before. Daniel brought a picnic basket over to the blanket and sat down next to mom. What's in the picnic, picnic basket? asked mom ti tiger. Picnic stuff, said Daniel, like plates, cups, napkins, food, and Tiggy. Daniel pulled Tiggy out of the picnic basket and hugged him close. Tiggy wants to see the fireworks too. Well, it's not quite time for dinner or fireworks, said Mom. Why don't you and Margaret play? Okay, said Daniel. Come on, Margaret, let's play. Come back here, Margaret, Daniel called out as giggling. Margaret toddled around the backyard. Daniel and Margaret were having so much fun. They didn't even notice that it was getting darker until suddenly they saw something new floating around. Look, Margaret, I see fireflies, Daniel exclaimed, pointing to the little flickering lights. See how they light up? Let's say hi to the fireflies. But Margaret didn't want to say hi to the fireflies. Margaret didn't know what they were. Margaret, come back, said Daniel as Margaret toddled to Mom Tiger. The fireflies said, nice, they won't hurt you. Daniel followed Margaret back to the picnic blanket. Why doesn't Margaret like the fireflies? He asked Mom. Well, Margaret has never seen a firefly before. To her, they're new. And new things can be scary sometimes. Can I help her? Daniel asked. Yes, I think you can, said Mom. When something is new, holding a hand can help you. When something is new, holding a hand can help you, said Daniel as he took Margaret's hand. Come on, Margaret, I'll hold your hand and we can look at the fireflies together. Daniel and Margaret held hand and walked back to the fireflies. Look at how the fireflies light up, said Daniel. It's like they're twinkling and saying hi. Margaret looked at Daniel and she looked at the fireflies. Hi, hi, she giggled. Margaret isn't as scared anymore, said Daniel happily. Watching the fireflies gave Daniel an idea. Daniel imagined that he was a firefly, dancing with his firefly friends. Daniel, Margaret, called mom. Come over to the picnic blanket for dinner. Daniel helped Margaret help, help take Margaret to the blanket where Dad was serving sandwiches, carrots, and grapes. Mmm, picnic food is tiger tastic, said Diner Daniel. It does taste better outside, doesn't it? said Dad. Suddenly Daniel heard a loud noise. Boom, boom, boom. What is that noise? asked Daniel. Daniel was scared. Those are fireworks, said Dad. See, up in the sky. Look how pretty they are, said Mom. They're kind of like fireflies, but they're really loud, said Daniel nervously. Fireworks are loud, said Dad. But that's just the noise they make. All of a sudden, Daniel felt a small hand holding his. It was Margaret. Fireworks are new for you and Margaret. Maybe you can help each other, said Mom. When something is new, holding a hand can help you, Daniel said as he squeezed Margaret's hand. Come on, my fussy guy, said Dad. Hold my hand too. Let's go get a better look at the fireworks. You might like them when you see how pretty they are. Okay, said Daniel, but I want to keep holding Margaret's hand too. Boom, boom, boom. The fireworks were really loud. But Daniel squeezed Margaret's hand, and Margaret squeezed Daniel's hand right back. Daniel, Margaret, Mom, and Dad watched as the fireworks lit up the sky with sparkly, bright colors. 
and Daniel Margaret liked them. Sometimes new things can be scary, but just remember, when something is new, holding a hand can help you. Aga maga!